you start realising how many people have been killed and uh, how many friends you've lost. I mean, I would like, to, I would like to everybody in this industry to, to watch footage of Piper and, and read the, the transcripts of some of the things the guys went through. The guys who did survive, or the guys who made up their mind, who said, I'm not biding here, I'm, I'm, marking, I'm marking my own way off. To witness things that nobody should have to see, smell things you shouldn't have to smell, and hear things you shouldn't have to hear. And then the smoke starts coming and it starts getting hotter. And some of the lads made the decision I'm not staying here no longer. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Really, when your back is to the wall, I think nature takes over. You know, I, I think we, we revert to instinctive action. There is no way, there is absolutely no way we can evacuate from here. All walkways are blocked. The first thing, medical support. We cannot evacuate at this point. They had then to get the courage to jump over the side from the highest point on the rig, the heli deck. Those lads, if nothing else, they've got courage and uh, they deserve to live. They went to climb down knotted ropes with um, a survival suit on, with heavy boots on, uh, with an inflated jacket on, some with very badly burned hands and burned faces, and it's dark and they're climbing down into water about two-thirds of which was on fire. You push to the limit and you know you are. And I decided drowning would be better than burning. It's at times like this that family pull you through. And I made that one more effort. I got back to the surface. And I said, I've got to try it. It stills in you. You've got to try to survive more. And you do. You do just that. I think one of the sides that, that, that hasn't been told enough about Piper were you know, occasions of real bravery um, and concern for other people. You kind of begin to even comprehend what those guys went through. The Piper Alpha, this tremendous um, fight for life through something that's worse than the worst nightmares you can possibly have. Um, that, that has to change people.